Again, I don't want to go through every single thing that you're going to do this semester in detail step by step, but I would like to go through the pattern that it will follow. And so why don't we take a look at lesson one in more detail, and that will show you how all lessons will follow from now until the end of the semester. There are a total of 23 lessons between now and the end of the semester. So when you look at the lessons, you'll see that in module two, there's lessons one through five. And when you get to the bottom of the module, there's an exam. So the exam will be based on the lessons inside that module. Looking at lesson one specifically, there are a list of learning objectives. These are the learning objectives that are synced on the course syllabus. If you click on the lecture materials, every lecture page will include a slideshow lecture that's embedded. If you want to download and print this, check the announcements tab. I've sent out a course announcement. It's a standardized one that comes at the beginning of the semester. It has a link to all of the files if you'd like to download them. You will not be able to download them from the lecture page. And on the right hand side will be a series of recorded videos. They're small, so I, rep I recommend popping them out. You can do that by hitting the little arrow in the top right hand corner and then click on the YouTube link. They're all on YouTube. And once you launch the first one, you can follow the YouTube account. It's called Open Graphic Arts and you will be able to see if we update any files. In addition to that, there is a note that says, please read this at least once, and I'm begging you to please read it at least once. On every single lecture page, there is a note that says that we used to require a textbook and we don't require any more. As of the spring 2018 semester, we are 100% textbook free. Whitney and I and other visual art design faculty have taken time to update all the slideshows and most of the lecture videos and all the skills practice demos to reflect not having a textbook, but we have not really recorded all of the lectures yet. And so you may come across a lecture that says to read certain pages in the textbook or to read a chapter in the textbook or to reference your reading assignment from the textbook. Please ignore any reference you ever hear in any of the videos that reference a textbook. You no longer have to use the textbook. This slideshow is really your textbook. If you were to read through the slideshow, you'll see that it reads more like a textbook and not like a PowerPoint slideshow. It has paragraphs of information.